guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for today's video, I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you how I created this apple eyeshadow makeup look. And if you're interested on how I created this makeup look, please keep on watching. So first of all, let's go prime muna nat. So disclaimer lang bago tayo magsimula. I'm gonna show you how I created this apple eyeshadow makeup look, not the full makeup look kasi yung mga ginamit ko on my face, yung mga foundation, such things is the same as my previous video. And if you haven't watched it yet, I'll link it down below. So without further ado, let's get started. So first of all, let's prime muna natin yung ating eyes and I'm using again this Urban Decay eyeshadow potion primer. testing ko tong look na to. Ginamit ko yung tong primer na to sa kabilang eyes. Tapos yung sa isa, ano lang, um, concealer lang. Tapos ano, ang hirap niya tanggalin. Pag tinanggal ko siya ng eye makeup remover, madali siya tanggalin. Pero itong primer na to, ang hirap niya tanggalin, girl. Nakailang cotton pad sa kong kakalagay. So yun, share ko lang. So moving on with our base, I'm using this Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. I'm using this shade para sa crease. So I'm just applying it using this Real Techniques Base Shadow Brush. I'm using Wiper Motion para lang sa base and sa crease ng ating eyes. This is an apple eyeshadow makeup look. I'm using this Modern Renaissance by Anastasia Beverly Hills again. Kasi dito, ito lang yung palette na may red ako. So, I'm using this shade, Red R. Tapos i-apply ko lang siya sa outer D. Closer ko pa para makikita niyo yung um, improvement After natin ligay yung red or simplify natin yung outer lids using this Naked Hit by Urban Decay again. And I'm using this shade Cayenne. And gamit ako ng gantong brush to amplify it. Then, babalik tayo sa red or para mas lalo nating i-spread through the middle eyelid. Then, for our, our inner eyelids, I'm using this kind of sponge. Para mas maano yung coverage ng ating inner eyelids, i-sprayin ko siya ng aking setting spray. And I'm using again this Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette in the shade. This two shades, pag smile ko sila, Lumbre and Dirty Talk. And after that, for our lower lash line, I'm using this angled brush from Swish. Tapos maglalagay ulit tayo ng red or sa ating eyes. Hindi kasi ako makontenta pag walang eyeliner sa aking eyes. So, I'm using this Hyper Sharp Liner from Maybelline. So, after natin mag-eyeliner, I'm curling my lashes using this eye curler from H&M. Bago natin lagyan ng false so for the falsies, I'm using this decorative eyelash, Dreamy Wink. And as you can see, wala na siyang laman kasi nag-iisang pair na lang kong natira.
Then after ko yung kapit yung mga falsies, ikakarl ko ulit siya para mag-incorporate yung falsies sa kanyang natural lashes. And since may mga whites pa from the eyelash glue, halayan ko ulit siya ng eyeliner. After ko lagyan ng eyeliner, I'm using this Lashionista by Maybelline Mascara. So, ito yung ipang mga mascara ko for both upper and lower lash. And since may blush na ako, didiretso na tayo sa highlighting. And I'm using this Lick Makeup Highlighting Palette in the shade Solstice. And I'm using this shade. So, kakamayin ko na lang para mas ano yung pigment niya sa, sa mukha. nakalagay na tayo ng lip balm. Diretso na tayo mismo sa mismong lipstick. I'm using this two lipstick from BLK in Vice Cosmetics. And ito muna yung unahin ko, si Vice Cosmetics in the shade Vice. And since this is an apple eyeshadow makeup look, so dapat yung lipstick mo is medyo um, bright dish, red, and may maroon. So, I'm using this BLK in the shade Caramel. Ito yung para magiging contrast niya sa lips. And again, to finish it off, I'm using this Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Be sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below if you have any video suggestions or if you have any makeup look. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye!